two authors explain how they are telling the stories of veterans because they believe military service should be celebrated and honored. And One America's Nathaniel Manor has more on their story. Republican voters have largely moved away from the neocon establishment in recent years, but their legacy of foreign wars and covert operations lives on. We may be unfamiliar with the soldiers who put their lives on the lines as part of undercover missions to safeguard American freedoms. I spoke with Brian Andrews and Jeff Wilson, Navy veterans and co-authors of Four Minutes, a techno-thriller about counterterrorism operations that can stop future attacks. While they are fiction writers, Andrews and Wilson explained they frequently draw on real-world events for inspiration. I mean, in one sense, I think it very much was inspired by 9-11, because if you think about 9-11, we always like to say, you know, gosh, there were some signs there, and if only we had seen them, maybe we could have acted uh, preventatively. And so we always ask these what-if questions that motivate our thrillers, and this question was, what if we had known about it in advance and had some warning, what would we have been able to do? So when you collect intelligence, there's always gaps. So imagine being able to jump 28 days into the future, and then you could look back and say, oh, we know an attack happened. Now we're going to try to stop it in the present. We do tend to write about things we know about. Uh, we've written in the past about, uh, you know, the invasion of Ukraine. Actually, we wrote that novel uh, before it happened. And the way Putin carried it out was very similar to what we wrote. So, you know, we follow geopolitics very closely, but we're not trying to take a stand on any one event. We just try to reflect the reality of the world in the books as best we can. Wilson said they write about military operations because their primary goal is to tell the stories of those who serve to protect Americans at home. And all of our work is just try to honor the people that uh, that are out there uh, fighting side by side uh, for our country and uh, try to show the sacrifices they make, the relationships that they forge and uh, the things that they do. Our stuff is very character driven. Uh, it's not it's relatively apolitical. It's uh, not geared towards any specific world power. For One American News, I'm Nathaniel Manor. For all our viewers asking where One America News is heading in the future, we would like to introduce you to OAN Live. OAN Live is the best way to stay up to date on all of the hard-hitting, straight-shooting, national and international headlines. And the best part is, OAN Live is only $4.99 per month. All the credible, honest, unbiased reporting One America News offers at a fraction of the cost of cable. Just go to OANN.com to easily sign up for OAN Live and stay informed.